what's up everybody in today's video i'm gonna be teaching you how to make a gorilla attack gorilla attack pfp in blender so the first thing that you're gonna want to do is you're gonna want to search up gorilla tag rig blender uh it sh should be the first link from nacho engine press the first thing and press download raw file once you do that, you're just going to want to open your blender. Press general. And then go back to your Google. Put it down a little bit. Go to your downloads. Go to the recent one. And then put it in and press open. It'll take a little bit. Alright. So, so once it's like that. You want to click on the gorilla for the color, go to the ver very bottom one, the material, and press primary color, and you can change the color. I'm just going to change it uh, like this blue. You could also become uh, dirt stones, all that stuff like that, lava, and ice. Alright. The next thing is the name. So first, you're going to want to click on the name. Where it says object mode, click it click it and make sure it's on edit mode and then you're gonna want to delete everything delete everything and put in the name that you want once you do that you're gonna want to go back to object mode and then there's your gorilla tag monkey okay so the next thing is uh press pose press object mode and press pose mode so now you could pose your gorilla and it, you might be thinking, oh, how do I um, make it so it's not moving both arms at a time? Well, but it's an easy fix. All you're going to want to do is, where it says pose options, turn off x-axis mirror. And then you should be able to move one arm at a time. For instance, I'm just going to keep it how it was. Alright, the next thing is... um. You press, uh, there should, a small little arrow right here, just press it, press view, and press camera to, vi to view. Um, oh, also, before we do the camera thing, sorry if you wanted to put cosmetics, cosmetics and custom faces on, sorry I don't know how to do that, but, uh, go check out Professor Wesser's video, because that, uh, he'll be showing how to do that. Okay. So now we press camera to view and then we press um take off camera to we just take off that and then there uh next thing you're gonna do is you're gonna press you're gonna press you're gonna go back to object mode you're gonna press add and then you're gonna add a camera once you do that, press the little camera button, zoom out to however you want your uh, character to be. But before you do that, go to this little tab, the output, and make sure the resolution is 100, 100, 1080. And then you could pose your gorilla however you want, just like that. Okay, the next thing you want to do is press render, render image. You're going to press image press save as and then save that image okay so the next thing we're going to do is we're done with blender so you can close up blender if you want but the, the next thing we're going to do is head over to your google chrome again and then type in photo p it should be the first link it's going to ask you like a couple qu questions before you get to the screen like sign up or something like that but then you're going to press new project instagram and then press create once, once you're here, you're going to press File, Open, open the Gorilla Tag um, PFP, and then press this little magic wand tool, and then you're going to want to go around the image like this, and then press Delete or Backspace on your computer like this, so it kind of looks like this. You just want to go around your image doing that. And once you go all around your image, you're going to want to find a background. 
so we are going to be doing a gr green wavy background so press file press open in place and then uh open a um open your background oh god <laughs> that, my bad that was from a different video um open in place my bad here uh for instance i'm just gonna use this one yeah <laughs> uh and then you're gonna want to adjust your size to your image and then if it's like th like this like it's in front of your gorilla uh click and hold the background and put just put under the gorilla so it's looking like this and then all you're gonna want to do from here is you can add text if you want but all you're gonna want to do from here is press file press export as png and then this doesn't really matter you could just zoom in and zoom out but anyways don't change anything here you could change the name to whatever uh here i'm just gonna do this to custom and then you're uh able to press save it'll save to your downloads and all you're gonna want to do is just go to gorilla tag nope not gorilla tag my bad you're gonna want to go to youtube um you want to go to YouTube, press your profile, uh, press customize channel, and then once it says picture, just press change and then open the file. That's how you pretty much do it. Anyways, thanks for watching. Bye.